Oh my freaking goodness, guys. I came home today and the kitchen is so much better. I'm, I'm super freaking happy right now. So I walk in. I knew that they were going to paint the hallways today. Um, they had called and uh, got my paint color from me. And uh, that was easy peasy. I did not change the color of the hallway. And I had an old paint can um, with a, just a little bit of paint left in it that they were able to uh, take to the store and match that paint color. So that was great. Um, the kitchen, like I'm about to show you this kitchen. It has come a long way today. Here's the hallway. Doesn't look much different. Obviously, they've taken um, some of the stuff down that was in the hallway. Um, I had some thing back there that said home. I had a, a dry erase board, and those two little things actually were hanging right here. I wonder if it's dry. Yeah, it's dry. Um, not dry enough to put stuff back on the wall yet, but this hallway, and uh, there's Kaylin, and this hallway right here have been repainted. Um, there was a drywall patch that I have to pay out of pocket for over here um my son and that child right there that you can see got into a fight and yeah they did they got into a fight and um there was a slight uh no they brought a no. stick in the house and put a no wall that was sarah and Layla. they, they brought a wall. stick in the house and they hit it on the wall Okay, they brought a stick in the house and hit it on the wall. I really wish, if you go back and look Ooh, at some of my other videos, hard. there there's got to be um, some glimpse of this this uh, patch that needed to be done. It doesn't look like a stick, guys. Like it does. It was well. Like a big your little stick. sister ratted y'all out and said y'all got into a fight. They look a fight. It'd be a bigger hole than that. Right. Does anybody else have this issue when you you don't even know what happened? Well, it doesn't matter. There was a drywall patch that's gotten fixed, so it looks great. Um, let's go into the kitchen. Automatically, you can see some stuff has been moved around. There is my stove that doesn't work. Hey, there's my dry erase board. Um, and there's the old cabinets that were damaged. Here are the cabinets. Like, oh my God, they hung my floating shelves up. Um, the cabinets are in. These are not the countertops. These are the damaged ones. Um, the new ones are coming in um, in about a week or so. So those will uh, go up once they come in. But I guess they just laid it up there to, uh, I don't freaking know, um, I guess to see which cabinet pieces went where or just to have somewhere to set stuff for the time being. Um, these have to be painted, obviously. These are the new ones. So the knobs will come off of these over here and go on to these. And all of these here will get repainted. Um, the upper cabinets are going to be installed on Monday. Like, hey, they hung my blinds back up too. I just now noticed that. Um, I'm going to think I'm going to go ahead and take those down again and uh, wash them. Like, look how nasty They're and yellow. dirty those things are. Like, it's yellow. That is insulation. And then there's just a lot of nastiness all over them from the ceiling collapsing and all of that good stuff. But yay like oh my gosh guys like i'm so freaking happy this is coming along it is looking so much better so let's see what else has to be done in here um what this tells me right now is some of these outlet uh covers i can put back on the wall um that means i can put that one back on and the ones that are down here below all of this and i can definitely put um, these two right here back on my backsplash doesn't start until right here in this little area and then it goes down so I'm not going to put the uh, whatchamacallit the outlet covers on on those just because of the the backsplash having to go up but um, I'm going to get that done this weekend just to kind of feel accomplished I think and um, yay like my goodness gracious looks like I got a crack going down the uh, center of my slab here that I've never ever noticed. Um, obviously I wouldn't because the uh, flooring is over the top of that. So that is going to conclude this video. A lot got done today. A lot. Um, this is this is amazing. I'm just whew, it's starting to feel like home again. I will be back in the kitchen and cooking before we know it. Um, what else has to be done in here? Um, or all of the house really insulation has to go back in um, that will all be going into the attic they're doing the insulation obviously over the kitchen because that whole entire ceiling came down the master bedroom which is behind uh, this wall here and then the living room which is the other side of this wall and then the hallways 
um, all need insulation put back into them. Um, the painting of the cabinets, the knobs, the flooring and the baseboards, the crown molding in the living room um, is falling due to the uh, water damage and the weight of the water pulling on that. Um, so that has to be fixed. And I believe painting the living room. I don't know 100% sure on that. The laundry room um, has to be painted. And there's a drywall patch in here that also has to be done. Um, I had a clogged pipe the other day. And some drywall got cut up. Um, so that has to be professionally patched, um, not by me. It's kind of hard to see, but there was a uh, there's a bathroom on the other side of this wall, and the pipe started leaking. Um, so some of the drywall was cut out to repair that pipe. Um, luckily, that happened um, while this whole entire house is a freaking mess right now. Um, I'm serious. If I didn't have bad luck, I literally wouldn't have any at all. Like, so much has happened to me this year. Um... The ceiling collapsing, all this water damage in the house. I've had car problems twice. This clogged pipe. Um, and that's just all I can think of right now off the top of my head. There's a lot of other little stuff that has happened. Thank y'all for watching this video. And I will see y'all on the next update.